What's up, YouTube? Welcome back. So this customer of ours, uh, the kids went away in this van. What is this? 2002 Chevy Astro van. And uh, he was here for an oil change and the spare tire fell off on my head, if you remember that. He fixed the broken sway bar. He told him it needed from brake work. So his budget could only allow for so much, so we didn't do the front brake work. So they, his family took the van on a road trip. Uh, the brakes were squeaking so bad, they stopped at a Mavis tire to get an estimate. They told him $600 for front pads and rotors. They also told him it's $300 more for bearings, for wheel bearings, and they told him that it had to be pressed in. Well, Mr. Mavis Mechanics, service managers, and everyone else who works at Mavis, this is not that style of brake job. These are cone and cup wheel bearings, and new rotors comes with the bearing races already pressed into them. Um, I haven't seen any in years and years and years that have not had the bearing races in it. Um, but an additional $300 to replace his wheel bearings with his rotors, taking the brake job towards $1,000. Front pads, front rotors, wheel bearings, and seals. You guys should be arrested. Um, but you're entitled to make the profit margins that you want and the profit that you want. But the problem with this is that I have is that you lied to the customer and said that the bearings have to be pressed in and out. A two-wheel drive Astro van does not require that. Needless to say, they told him just to slap a set of pads on it for now, which is the best choice for them. And then he was telling me the story about his visit, their visit to Mavis, and I said, well, at the next time that you need brake pads, we will reevaluate your car, because I didn't take his wheels off and check anything. I just told him, hey, you need brake work in the front. Uh, your brakes are noisy. Thanks for watching.